I get a kick out of supporting new and existing horror talent. I've introduced loads of short horror films which are now available on my website bleedingcritic.com All waiting for you now to explore if you want a break from YouTube or Netflix. So this guy sent me his short horror film and I absolutely love it. This film Grandma's House is the perfect example of sustained tension, unpredictable, unrushed, beautifully filmed demonstrating a writer slash director who I'm confident will be making full length horror films in the future. Joshua told me that the core draw for him making the film was the character of Grandma. He said to me, my own grandma had just recently passed away prior to filming and in a way this was how I paid my respects to her legacy, her wisdom, mischief and ruggedness that could only have been earned by living a long and full life. Grandma's house was filmed over two weekends, three days in total on a shoestring budget at a single location in Los Angeles. This director discovered the actress who played Grandma when she responded to a flyer he had posted in her apartment complex. She's never acted before. Joshua's love for the horror genre began when he was a kid in the basement of his grandparents' New York country house, where his dad would set up a pair of chairs, he would kill the lights and then screen classic horror films for this impressionable young boy to witness. Joshua, I got a great feeling about you and I hope me introducing this short film of yours will increase your chances of success. Well done mate and never stop doing what you do. For the rest of you explore his website. It's time for you all to stop. Just stop thinking. Stop moving about and focus on what you are about to witness. This is Grandma's house.
Check out my other YouTube channel, Horror Stories from the Clown.